I. In this example, we're given the variable t, and we're told that it represents the number of years since 2000. And then they tell us this, t equals negative 4, and we're asked to interpret what that means. So let's go back to this phrase, t is the number of years since 2000. And we can say, okay, well, if t is negative 4, that means that the number of years since 2000 is negative 4. So we could say it this way. That wouldn't be our final answer. That's not how we talk in English. If you went up and said that to someone on the street, they wouldn't know what you were talking about. The number of years since 2000 is negative 4. So let's think about uh, what we mean when we say negative 4 or the opposite of 4. Well, we're, here it's set up to be the number of years since 2004, or the number of years after, sorry, the number of years after 2000 is negative 4. So if we're talking about negative years since something, it means we're really talking about before 2000. That negative symbol is telling us it's before 2000. And how many years is it before 2000? It's four years before 2000. So we could say it is four years. before 2000. That's a slightly better way of saying it, but still, if you went up to someone on the street and said it's four years before 2000, they might think, okay, but there's a simpler way to say it, right? Well, what year was it four years before 2000? We can calculate that by taking the base year 2000 and subtracting four. That gives us 1996. So really, the best way to say this would be to say the year is 1996. 